Welcome back uh, ladies and uh, gentlemen, uh, this is a uh, double update and a very big shout out to everybody who is uh, listening uh, right now. Haiti politicians deals President Ruto a new blow in a uh, police deployment push. President William Ruto has suffered a major blow given the latest developments on matters deployment of police officers to Haiti. According to reports is that Section of politicians in Haiti have refused to appoint representatives in the council that will allow the deployment of police to Haiti and more so help in uh, matters elections and uh, transition. Gang leader in Haiti, Cheriaz Barbecue, has also warned uh, President Ruto that deployment of police officers to Haiti is ex extremely unnecessary and something that uh, will not be accepted. It's a fact that most political leaders are against plans by Kenyan government to deploy police officers to Haiti. President Ruto has remained resolute and clear that deployment of police officers to Haiti is a must and it's something that's not optional. It's a fact that those who have focused on impunity in government worked against the interest of Haiti will be exposed. What's your thought on this one? Just drop your comment in the comment section, but uh, subscribe for more news. Anyway, on the other side, UDMP turn gun against fellow Kenya Kwanzaa MPs openly read a Bible verse to mock them over the punitive uh, taxes. Honorable Kamau Murango, the UDA allied MP for Kirinyaga County, has reportedly directed guns at the Kenya Kwanzaa MPs who voted for the finance bill 2023 that has seen punitive taxes introduced on agricultural produce such as avocado. According to the report by the Standard newspaper, Horrible Kamamurango is reported to have used popular Bible verse to castigate those who introduce unjust taxes to suppress the poor. Also, Kamau is said to have slammed the MPs for failing to go by the mood of the voters who elected them. That notwithstanding, Kimani Chungwa during a phone call interview with KT News yesterday said that nobody is perfect and that, that when something is unfavorable, it is removed or amended. He said punitive taxes will be removed in the next finance bill 2024.